man came to Jesus and said, my daughter's dying. She's, she's even now at the point of death. And Jesus started to go toward him. And that's when the woman with the issue of blood came up behind him and grabbed his hem of his garment and stopped him. But yet it took a little bit of time there. And then as they start to go again, somebody comes and says, don't trouble the master anymore. Your daughter's dead. And the first thing Jesus said, it, it doesn't say the man said anything at that point. The next thing it said is that Jesus said, only believe, fear not, only believe. In other words, keep your mouth shut. I told you I'm going to come heal her. Keep your mouth shut. See, that's the problem. Most people don't know how to keep their mouth shut. They, they tell every bad thing. And they have to share it with everybody. Oh, have you heard the news? Oh, have you heard that? Oh, yeah, it's worse. Oh, it's bad. It's getting worse. Yeah. Oh. And then they try to hide it when they realize they're getting into doubt and unbelief. But, but you know, we're believing God for a miracle. Well, don't talk about the devil for 45 minutes and then talk about God for two. Turn that around. You might say, well, here's what the devil's trying to do, but here's what God said. And here's what he's going to do. Why? Because be it unto me according to his word. Here's what's going to happen. 